boat captures everything we've learnt over the last three years as a company. It'll be the most developed boat from launch that we run through the whole campaign. Behind me we've got the delivery of Lander of BAR's first race boat, so R1 is the, the code name for it. And, you know, it's great to finally have it here and see what we're going to be racing in Bermuda. It's going to look like a proper weapon once we get it in the water. From the boat builders to the, to the systems guys, to the sailors, to the designers, you know, there's just so much time and effort put into making one of these boats. In the most stressful moments with R1 so far would be the structural test where we turn the boat upside down and do all our inversion tests. We have a six week fit out period before we ship the boat, pack the boat back up and ship it over to Bermuda. Obviously the launch day one and the first sailing day is that's your last chance to sort of prove that you've done everything that needs to be done and that's a stressful moment for, for a little while and then a big sigh of relief when it all goes well. Yeah, it's a massive day for the team to get our race boat out in the water sailing uh, for the first time. It was a really, really promising sail. I think we can uh, see a lot of the upgrades coming together and um, increasing our performance markedly, which is where we need to be. So, good day for the team. And it gets very passionate at times because you know, people believe in this boat and they want to move it forward quickly. And everyone's got a bunch of ideas, so we've got to be quite methodical and, and test them on the water. Well, I think we hope that you know, the boats is the fastest boat on the water. You know, the whole company in general is working hard to make sure that is the case. The boat has also got to be easy enough to sail so we can get it around the course, keep it on the floors the whole time. Most importantly, it's got to be the fastest boat.